Good night, good night, how one does tonight. My name is Ermie J. Spirits Divine. I'm here to give you a, a little short news on tonight. A word um shut down. I think we got like 12 days. Uh, 12 days. Now, now the leader announced, you know, a word of shutdown. You know, the country leader had a uh, agreement on the overall, you know, the price tag of the next government shutdown. You know, so the BLM maker announced on today a major step towards avoiding a partial shut shutdown. So we're trying to avoid the, the, uh, the shutdown, you know, that is set to begin later this month. You know, so so a partial government shutdown could be under two weeks away from now. You know, it could begin at midnight, January the 19th of this month, you know, without action to avert, avert avoid it. You know, so so uh, we got about two weeks. We got two weeks. Um, we got two weeks, and we have to uh, try to avoid this uh, shutdown. You know, so House Speaker, you know, he announced his agreement. You know, had been reached on top of line spending level. You know, so we have twelve days left to come up with a good budget. Oh, uh, for this uh, shutdown. Um, now. Uh, what that was in November, the uh, House Speaker had came up with a budget, you know. So I guess he have to do another budget. Oh, uh, that must have because no uh, president has signed for it, you know. So we have twelve days if we have to do another uh, a new budget for uh, to over uh, to um uh, shutdown, you know. So I do have another news for you. Um, the border. I know I talked to you yesterday about that. You know, you may not may, may not able, you know, to secure the whole border for a a hundred percent. You know, but it needs to be secure in some kind of way. You know, so uh, what we may have to do, um, that certain amount of immigrants to uh, cross over the border. You know, like I had said yesterday, if we have an overflow. Uh, uh, immigrant coming through, we might have to shut it down, you know, because we have to catch and make sure that it's legal passing through, meaning they still have to uh, show uh, information when they come through the border, you know. So, um, I know you said the budget is 14 billion, you know, to have all these things done, to be having security, security done. And uh, they uh, they 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 getting dropped off and and not have a proper uh residence to sleep at, you know. So it's a lot of things uh, a budget that we um uh, that a bill that we have to come up with, you know. So a lot of things is not in place, you know. So I will have to come up with something, uh, to make sure uh for these immigrants because they they come into states. They come to different states and not properly, you know, being registered uh, for any kind of um, housing, you know. So all that has to be done before they even get to um, to all the other states, before they even cross over the border, you know. It has to be done, you know. So aside my, I got to see what's going on with that, you know, because uh, it's, it's freezing cold. And, and it was out there in the cold sleeping because they had no kind of apartment or housing uh, arrangement. You know, so a lot of that had to go with, had to, they had to deal with that before they cross over. They can't go to another state and don't have no weather state in the outside in the cold. We about to get some more cold weather and we getting rain in the mix of it. You know, so it's a lot of things that need to be done at this border, you know. They have to have some kind of housing arrangement before they cross the border. Because they can't keep on being just, just dropped off if they don't have nowhere to stay. You know, they still have to show information before they cross the border. You know, so uh, I, would, I would have to come up with something and uh, see what's going on with the assignment. Because they have to have some kind of arrangement before they even cross over. You know, we can't keep them having them crossing over and they don't have nowhere to stay. We can't have them outside, you know, because some, somebody, someone was um, running them from sleeping outside 
and you know, and they'll leave and come right back because they have to make some kind of arrangement for us to stay. You know, so all this has to be done before they cross over. They can start going online. You know, start going online and see what state have available hotels until they can find an apartment. You know, so these are type of things that have to be done before they cross over. Um, um so um they have to um they have to show they have to show an ID. If they don't have an ID, they have to show their green card. You know, oh, I think they need the ID and the green card to cross over. You know, to have to be legal before they cross over to another state. And now what I want them to do is they, uh, well, if they don't have no kind of housing arrangement, they cannot cross over. Because you can't have them going to another state sleeping outside and don't have nowhere to stay. You know, so all that has to be done before they cross over. You know, so we uh we we talk about the shutdown. It's coming up soon in twelve days. You know, so uh oh, uh, we trying to about uh, the uh the partial shutdown. We have to make sure uh we have to come up with a budget. We have to come up with a um budget before before another shutdown. You know, and we have to come up with a budget. So we won't have this kind of problem the next time, you know. So that's all the short news I have for you today. You have a blessed, safe night, and I see y'all the next video.